San Antonio police officers arriving to a shooting call found themselves under fire. They were dodging bullets at an apartment complex on the northeast side of town near Raybon Drive and Eisenhower Road. Katrina Weber is live at this scene. Now, Katrina, we understand that several police cars were hit by gunfire. Well, we just got a briefing within the last 10 minutes from Police Chief William McManus. He's telling us that a total of five patrol cars were hit by gunfire this morning. One of them hit about 40 times. Those shots, they believe, were fired by a man who killed his roommate and then killed himself. Now, this all happened here at Eisenhower and Raybon, an apartment complex right there on Raybon Drive. You can still see some flashing lights there from police. But this area looks completely different from how it did earlier this morning. I have video video to show you just how many police officers were in this area. The chief tells us every available officer was here. Called here about 2 o'clock this morning by someone who says that they knew of a man who had shot and killed his roommate. Officers arrived for that call, that call initially, but they say once they got here, they found themselves under fire from that man shooting at officers, uh, firing at least one shot at the helicopter that was flying overhead. And we've also heard possibly also toward other first responders, but that's not confirmed. However, uh, police say that this gunfire went on for about a half hour. They evacuated people from the apartment building involved and uh, moved them to safety because they say that this man was firing everywhere, uh, to quote the chief. Uh, he says that uh, once SWAT officers were able to go inside, they did find that man and his roommate both dead from gunshots. They believe this is a murder-suicide. Now, right now, they are still processing that apartment, still uh, working in that area, so they are not allowing people in that immediate vicinity to go home just yet. Those people out of their houses since about 2 o'clock this morning. But definitely a very scary situation. I asked the chief about all of the shootings we've been hearing here in the city, and he says he's never seen anything like this. He doesn't understand what is causing it, uh, but he does know, he says, that it doesn't take much for someone to pick up a gun and shoot lately, and he's, again, not sure why this is happening. Reporting live on the Northeast side, Katrina Weber, KSAT 12 News. Keep up to date with all of San Antonio's top news, weather, and so much more by clicking the like and subscribe buttons below. And once again, thanks for watching KSAT.